Hey yo, qu'est-ce que se passe les bébés? Ici votre boy Mev avec une tête d'ananas qui n'a pas réellement une tête d'ananas parce que j'ai un durag sur la tête. De retour avec la série 2022 des micro trottoirs Guys, ok, vous avez été patient. <rire> En réalité, je vais pas vous mentir, je vous dois deux micro trottoirs. Si tu sais pas pourquoi, c'est parce que tu me follow pas sur Instagram. T'es mieux de me follow tout de suite, c'est là qu'on est connecté ensemble. Mais, mais bref, pour un des posts, j'ai dit si ce post a 10 000 likes, je vais faire un nouveau micro trottoir. Je vous le dois, ok Puis je sais qu'est-ce que vous aimez les micro trottoirs. Vous aimez moi, bien sûr, j'espère. Vous aimez les cocottes et vous aimez le contenu qui vient avec. Fait que les gars, je me suis dit, je vais aller à Miami Beach. Je vais essayer de vous faire du contenu comme que je peux vous faire, mais je vais pas vous mentir. <rire> Les gars qui étaient supposés filmer pour moi m'a choqué. So, je me suis débrouillé avec ce que je pouvais les gars. J'ai plusieurs micro trottoirs de Miami qui sont prêts pour vous. La seule condition que j'ai pour vous, c'est que si on atteint le like goal, je vous sors le prochain micro trottoir. So, pour cette vidéo, 3000 likes seulement. 3000 likes seulement, je vous sors le prochain micro trottoir Miami, guys. On va voir si ça marche avec vous, qu'on fasse ça un peu en anglais. Si ça vous dérange pas, ça me dérange pas de faire le tour du monde, faire les meilleurs micro trottoirs de n'importe quelle langue. Je vous, je vous fous des sous-titres, je sais pas. Mais bref. Appréciez la vidéo les gars. Alright, so I'm at the beach today with Daniela. Oh Daniela. <laughs> Daniela. Ah Daniela. Eh? Gabriela. Just Vanessa. Vanessa, Vanessa, where are you from? I'm from Taiwan. Yo, can you speak me some uh Speak huh? Mandarin. Mandarin? Uh -huh. Okay, okay. Um, Wajal, Wasan, Jaden. Oh, yeah. Hi, nice. Uh, ni hao. Culture, it's culture. It's all about culture. So, Elizabeth, hi. Elizabeth, oh, where did I name from? Elizabeth. Elizabeth? I'm, I'm Panamanian. South America, so you're Latina? Yes. Oh, okay. Hola, tu habla español? Si. Mucho, mucho? Si hablo, yeah. Ah, yeah, no, I'm not that good. <laughs> <laughs> so, my question today is. What's your biggest turn on when it comes to men? If you can make me laugh, that's I feel like that's like the one. If you can make me laugh and if you're not pushy. Right. So just like going like go with the flow and funny. And like what's your type of humor? <laughs> I love skits and I like I like making shit up. Yeah. So if you could continue a skit with me, yeah. kind of, and if you're just like funny. Let's make a skit about you being my girlfriend, my Instagram model. What do you think? I don't know about that. It has to smell good. All right. Yeah. Smell good, so like. And their smile. smile. They have to have a good smile. Oh my god! And then <laughs> tough, 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 tough. Uh, I like guys being gentle, gentle. to women and be polite. Yeah. Gentle and polite, romantic guys. Y'all listening to this? Gentle and polite. When they're dominant, like when they take action. Let's say like we're having an argument. I don't like a guy that he'll just be like. All right, bye. Like I'm not gonna argue with you. Like no, I like a guy that's like sit down. Like, yeah, but listen, happen. listen. The problem is, how could you win against a Latina? You can't. Tall. Yeah. Gold chain. Yeah. Tan. tan. Gray sweatpants. Does this count? Gray sweatpants. You know what are the gray sweatpants <laughs> for, huh? I mean, does that count like a tan or like what's up? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, and I'm. Am I? Am I? Am I, am I tall enough? Like God, yeah. Yeah, I'm you're not definitely sure. tall enough. I right, appreciate it. All right, so I'm at the beach with Kira. Kira, what's what's your name here, Kira? Art. All right. Okay, so you're an artist. My mind, my body, my soul. It's all unique. Okay, it's all art. What's your biggest turn on in men? Tattoos. Definitely. I love tattoos. You're hot. You have a tattoo. Darn. Anything else? Anything else? <laughs> I like my man of color, I'm not gonna lie, I do. Oh, no, I lack it, so I gotta get it somewhere else. I mean, yeah, yeah. I feel you, I feel you. I, am I cute enough to be your boyfriend? Yeah. See, I like that talk. On a scale from yeah. 1 to 10, what would you give me? You're like really cute, you're like a 10. A 10? Yeah. Alright, you. we were talking about your beauty. On a scale from 1 to 10, how much do you give you? I think I'm an 11. See, you're not ugly, I like that. Confident, confident, confident. Hey, I'm is today my lucky day where I could get a kiss from you? Okay. <laughs> Appreciate it. I give myself a seven. I give you like a a nine just because yeah. you have the red in your hair. So the red be winning nowadays. I right, right. so, so like would I be cute enough to be your boyfriend? Fuck yeah. Last question for you before I take your Instagram. <laughs> kiss or slap? Should I kiss her? <laughs> yeah. I'll kiss you. What happened in Miami stays in Miami. Okay, you know? period. So hey, you live one hour away? I might see you around. Okay, yo. Yeah. Am I cute enough to be your boyfriend? Um, I have a boyfriend. Stop the cap. <laughs> I'm not sure. How can you not be sure? You can just say yes, no, you know? Honesty is key to a relationship. 
But what if I don't like your personality? I'm ready to bet all my life you'd prefer my personality over my looks. That's for sure. Why am I going to argue with a Latina if I could never win? Because it's fun. Because you just like to argue to argue, huh? Yeah, it's called being toxic. <laughs> Yo guys, vous allez tellement pas me croire, mais je sais pas qu'est-ce qui se passe en ce moment. Je pense qu'il y, une... <rire> y a une compétition de speedo qui se passe. What the f That's crazy. Oh shit. Hey, sorry guys. What is happening here? Yeah, what's happening here? Yeah, what's happening uh, here? The Winter Party Festival. Winter Party Festival. Yeah, it's like a gay festival, music festival. Ah. Oh. Just enjoying the sun, the beach. You know, that's life. That's life. That's man. life. Yeah, All right, I wasn't sure. So I'm at the beach today with. Kayla, you got nice eyes. I like it. Gabby. Yeah, all right, Gabby. So my question today is, what's your biggest turn on when it comes to men? Um, just being confident. Neck kisses. Start a conversation, not really just compliment me. Uh, not small talk, like something like meaningful, I guess. Yeah. Like, what do you study in? What's your major? Yeah. Do you get approached by guys? Yeah, yes. obviously. <laughs> okay, so like, what happens here? Like, you get approached, you don't get approached? Not really, no. She does. She's the one that gets approached. Nah, I feel cap. I smell cap. Damn, okay, okay. All right, all right. I'll come give you more attention. I got you, I got you, I got you. What's your type of guy? Uh, my boyfriend. Your boyfriend? So you do... Yeah, that's why I don't get approached. I have a boyfriend. But how do they don't know that. Good point. All right, so I'm on the beach today with... Stephanie. Natalie. Paola. Pearl. Michaela. So what's your name? My name's Liv. Liv. Yeah. Alright Liv, so what's your biggest turn on in a man? When they're nice. When they're nice? <laughs> and they're confident. And confident? Um, I guess confidence. Oh. Yeah, so you just have to have confidence, even if you don't know what you're doing. Pretend like you do, fake it till you make it, because that's how you get the lady. No, I think girls like guys that are, I don't know, nice and themselves. I like guys who like have good priorities. Good priorities. Tell me, what are good priorities? Well, I don't like guys who like care about like superficial stuff. Like, I like a good smart guy. Like you don't even have to be smart. You just have to like try. A good smart guy. Yeah. I study at Harvard University. What's up? Really? Yeah. yeah. You just gotta be different. You gotta be like funny and like you know. It's like you can't just be like the same like puppy chulo that everybody else is. You know? Hey, like you think in your hot shit. Like in reality, like no, we're all just people. Like you know. And a dad bod. Dad bods are in. <laughs> you gotta you gotta start eating more. So I'm When I'm nice with shorties, I always end up with a friend zone. Like, what's up with that? I'm so, committed to one girl. I ask you this question: Am I the type of guy who doesn't seem like committed to one girl? No. What you mean, no? 